What Do You Care What Other People Think, is a collection of autobiographical essays written by Richard P. Feynman, a Nobel Prize-winning physicist who made significant contributions to the field of quantum mechanics. The book is a follow-up to Feynman's earlier work, Surely You're Joking, Mr. Feynman, and offers a more personal perspective on his life and career. The essays in What Do You Care What Other People Think are loosely connected and cover a wide range of topics, from Feynman's childhood in Far Rockaway, New York, to his work on the Challenger Space Shuttle disaster. However, one of the recurring themes throughout the book is Feynman's unconventional approach to life and his refusal to conform to societal expectations. Throughout the book, Feynman presents himself as a curious and independent-minded individual who is not afraid to question authority or challenge conventional wisdom. For example, in the essay, What Do You Care What Other People Think?, Feynman describes how he was once told by a teacher that he was not good at drawing, but instead of accepting this judgment, he decided to teach himself how to draw by studying textbooks and practicing every day. Similarly, in the essay, The Smartest Man in the World, Feynman recounts how he once met a man who claimed to be the smartest person in the world, but instead of being impressed, Feynman was skeptical and asked the man a series of probing questions to test his intelligence. Feynman's independent streak is also evident in his approach to science. He was not content to simply accept established theories and dogma, but instead was always questioning and looking for new insights. In the essay, The Dignified Professor, Feynman describes how he once attended a conference where a well-respected professor presented a paper on a topic that Feynman had already done extensive research on. However, instead of simply nodding along with the professor's presentation, Feynman pointed out several errors and inconsistencies in the professor's work. Another recurring theme in the book is Feynman's love of adventure and his willingness to take risks. For example, in the essay, Lucky Numbers, Feynman describes how he and a friend once decided to go on a cross-country trip without any specific plans or destinations in mind. Similarly, in the essay, Los Alamos from Below, Feynman describes how he and a group of colleagues climbed a mountain to get a better view of the Los Alamos National Laboratory, where they were working on the development of the atomic bomb. Despite his unconventional approach to life and his tendency to question authority, Feynman also had a deep sense of responsibility to society and a desire to use his scientific expertise to make the world a better place. This is perhaps best exemplified by his work on the Challenger Space Shuttle disaster, which is the subject of the final essay in the book. In this essay, Feynman describes how he was asked to serve on the presidential commission that investigated the disaster, and how he uncovered the technical flaws and bureaucratic failures that led to the tragedy. In conclusion, what Do You Care What Other People Think is a fascinating and engaging book that offers a unique glimpse into the life and mind of one of the greatest scientific minds of the 20th century. Feynman's unconventional approach to life and science, his love of adventure and risk-taking, and his sense of responsibility to society all make for a compelling and inspiring read.